Hey guys, welcome to my channel where I create magical, nerdy and weird things. This time I decided that Settlers of Catan board game needs tokens for more than just 4 players. And a frame. And boxes for wooden pieces. I know that you can get all of that online, but there is no fun in that. Starting with the road piece, I used 5 by 5 mm stick that I marked and cut in pieces were 2.5 cm in length. You can see how long ago I started this project by the size of my lovely cat Lucky, and she still had 4 legs then. For cutting wooden pieces I used this handy electric saw. Next on the list are little houses that marks villages on the playing board. Leo helped me cut the piece of wood to the correct thickness and then I traced one of the original houses using it as a blank. Of course, none of my crafting projects can go without a hitch, and the saw blade broke. As I did not have any spare, I continued to saw all the small town tokens with a hand saw, and it took way longer than I thought it would. After I sanded all the pieces and completely moved my creative studio, it was time for painting. I used acrylics paint from a local store in colors that were missing in my Catan set. When the paint was completely dry, I covered everything in a coat of clean spray varnish. Now the player pieces were finished, but what about the boxes to store them in? These were designed and 3D printed after a bunch of trials and errors. You can see all of that in my next video. I 
I hope that you like this weird crafting project with a lot of cat videos. Thank you for watching. See you in the next one. Have a magical day.